In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to lube your clock. So we have our clock right here and the pins sound like that. It's a bit annoying and also it's slightly fast. So I'm going to try to fix that. So what you will need is a screwdriver. Here's a unnecessarily big screwdriver and I probably should find something better here. You'll also need some gravitas, which is one of my favorite lubes. And I think it'll work really well in the clock. I'll just open my Gravitas, put that aside, then I'm going to unscrew. I can't, uh, I can't use this short screwdriver. Okay. Make sure you don't lose any of these uh, nuts and you just want to pull apart like from the top and you'll get a clear top piece that you can put aside for now. Then you can pull the other bottom clear top, clear bottom piece. And now you'll have just literally the bare bones clock, which you can kind of pull apart. Don't force it too much. Okay, here you go. It really doesn't matter which one you put in where, so you could just kind of disassemble and just put it anywhere you want. So. What you'd expect is to try to lube these pins. However, I think the more reasonable approach is to actually lube these front cages. So I'm gonna take a little bit and what I'm going to do is lube these circular, I don't know what you call these, but lube these pieces and you wanna do this very lightly. And that's pretty much it. Um, it's really that e easy. You don't want to use something like DNM37 because first of all, it will run out into these front pieces. So you will get like weird blotches of black liquid. And also that's why we, we try to use as a little uh, of this heavy silicone lube. And that's also why we happen to use Gravitas because Gravitas isn't too heavy. Now to assemble this, it's going to be really easy. They are not the corners, they're the edges. And then you want to take these and place the white side on the black ones. And then take your pins and place the white side down. Place the black edges on the other one. And insert. Before you close the plate, you want to just like um wipe down any excess leaves on the pin finally you can put these plates back on put your screws back in and now if you hear the sound compared to before it sounds a lot better so time for some solves Well, that's it for this video. I think this setup turned out really great. And if you did enjoy this video, please consider subscribing. And until next time, go Luba Clock.